too. Well, the Medical Mutual Glass City Marathon is getting very close. Coming up Sunday, April 28th. Talking more about it this morning, of course, is race director Clint McCormick. Hey, Clint, nice to Good see you. Good morning, Abby. So how's registration going? Very strong. We're up over last year. So oh, great. We're Congratulations. over 5,700 runners now, so we're approaching our magic number of 6,000. Wonderful. Okay, so hopefully the weather will be good for that. Right. Um, are any waiting for John James to give me right. that forecast. Pressure's on, Jeff. So no pressure over there. <laughs> oh, baby. <laughs> Um, so tell me um, how, or as far as each race is concerned, are any mm -hmm. of the races filled up? No, we still have some general, um, I'm sorry, some charity registrations places open. Okay. Um, so if you're interested in donating to Mommy Valley Habitat for Humanity, mm -hmm. uh, Family House, Catholic Charities, um, you know, and we've got a few others that have just a few spots left. I think, you know, Mommy Valley may have like eight spots left. Oh, so wow. okay. if you're looking to donate to a cause, $50 of your registration goes straight to them. Um, and that's a way to get into the half marathon now. Okay, now I do want to talk about this. I had read um, on the glasscitymarathon.org website that there is a big event for kids on Saturday before the marathon. Right, so we've had about 250 kids the last few years mm -hmm. and um, you know started just a few years ago. But really what we tried to do is you know introduce young kids mm -hmm. um, to healthy living and running activities. Um, so we have three different activities um, or running events on Saturday from ages two to 12. Oh, wow. So if your child just learned how to walk, bring him out. You know, right. I'll have my one-year-old out there, and I've got right. a four-and-a-half-year-old, so she'll, she'll be out there, and they love it. But they all get teddy bears, and they get finisher medals. Um, now, the finisher medals, we do have a rubber end rather Very than Very nice. Now, how much metal. is that for the kids? Ten dollars. Okay. 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 Um, and we've got the UT football team out there. Oh, that nice. That'll stretch them out, run with oh, them. Oh, the kids love so, that. Yeah, that's it's, great. it's really one of the highlights of my weekend. Yeah. Very nice. All right, so that's the Saturday, right? This is on the 27th. Right. And then again, um, the race, what time does it start on the 28th? On the 28th, 7 a.m. Okay. Um, start time for the main event, which is the marathon and a half and the relays, and then 7.15 for the 5K. Okay, and of course, our station, WNWO, we're going to be out there. We're proud to be sponsoring this. We're going to be out there doing some live coverage, of course. And again, to register, glasscitymarathon.org. And you can also read all about the history of the race. It's just a really right. great website. It has all of the information you could possibly want. Right. All right, Clint McCormick, we certainly appreciate you being here as always. We'll see you next week, and we're going to actually have even some runners in here as well next week. All right, thanks so much, Clint.